Good Saturday morning to you folks. Hopefully things are going well with you here on this second day of January. Uh, yesterday, after <laughs> um, uh, my devotion, um, I had I was scheduled to work to, to sit all day uh, with a patient. And actually, I sat with two patients yesterday. So I was out um, all day. But uh, New Year's Eve, uh, I went to bed about 1030 knowing I would be working. But we had our son, our daughter-in-law, our little granddaughter, and then our daughter uh, were here. And they were going to play games and play uh, Scrabble and whatever. And my wife, Teresa, doesn't stay up late, usually. Not real late. <sighs> About a little after 6, uh, Friday morning, uh, New Year's Day, she came in to get in bed. <laughs> they had stayed up all night laughing and playing games and had a great time. And, of course, um, I couldn't do that because I had to work. So I left um, shortly um, after 7 and went to work. But uh, today, you'll have to excuse the t-shirt. I've got a funeral later today, and uh, I figured this would be a good time to rest a little bit and to catch up uh, on some of my reading here. Let me uh, read to you a piece of scripture from the book of Psalms. In chapter 51, one of my favorite scriptures says, um, Have mercy upon me, O God, according to thy loving kindness, according unto the multitude of thy tender mercies, blot out my transgressions. Wash me thoroughly from mine iniquity, and cleanse me from my sin. For I acknowledge my transgressions, and my sin is ever before me. Against thee and thee only have I sinned, and done this evil in thy sight, that thou mightest be justified when thou speakest, and be clear when thou judgest. Behold, I was shapen in iniquity, and in sin did my mother conceive me. Behold, thou desirest truth, in the inward parts, and in the hidden part, thou shalt make me to know wisdom. Purge me with hyssop, and I shall be clean. Wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. And of course, there's uh, more to this. So we know this is where he says, uh, don't cast me away, restore unto me the joy of thy salvation. He meaning uh, David, that is. But I want to touch on this one verse. Purge me with hyssop, and I shall be clean. Wash me, and I shall be whiter than than snow. Um, folks, David knew that he couldn't cleanse himself, uh, just as we should know that this isn't something that we can do ourselves. I mean, here it is. We Maybe you have, it's the second day of January. Maybe you have a New Year's resolution. You're going to be better at this. You're not going to eat the wrong stuff. You're not going to, whatever it is. Uh, I, I have friends, I know people who have went into certain programs trying to clean up their life, and I commend them for that, and I think that's great. But those programs don't save you, save your soul, and prepare you for heaven no more than just attending church does, uh, if you understand what I'm saying. Maybe you're an alcoholic, and you say, I'm going to go, and I'm going to start uh, going to these meetings, and that's great, and it gets you off alcohol, and it saves you money, and it saves your family, and all that stuff. I'm for all of that, but don't ever think that uh, because you gave up uh, bad habits and you cleaned yourself up, that you're cleaned up and ready to go to heaven. David said, cleanse me with hyssop, and I shall be whiter than snow. Wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. And he's the one that paid it all. Jesus paid it all. And that's what this song says. When we lived in uh, Myrtle Beach in Little River, South Carolina, um, I've done radio for years, and, and I just started looking online for an AM radio station to maybe put a radio program on. And there happened to be one in Tabor City, North Carolina, which where we lived in Little River. It took me um, just about uh, 45 minutes, 40 minutes maybe to get there, depending on the speed you drove. And we started a radio program there, and the title was Jesus Paid It All. And all I ever sang was the first verse uh, for the beginning and ending because that's what I needed as a theme song but uh, the whole song is good and so we're going to sing it today and uh, hopefully it'll be something that you realize that Jesus paid it all for you. You didn't pay it for yourself the preacher didn't pay it for you. No one else could pay it for you. No one else could clean you up. Jesus paid it all. I hear 
the Savior say, Thy strength indeed is small, Child of weakness, watch and pray. Find in me thine all in all. Jesus paid it all, all to him I owe. Sin had left the crimson stain. He washed it white as snow. Lord, now indeed I find Thy power and Thine alone Can change the leper's spots And melt the heart of stone Jesus paid it all, all To Him I owe Sin had left the crimson stain he washed it white as snow for nothing good have I whereby thy grace to claim I'll wash my garments white in the blood of Calvary's Lamb, Jesus paid it all, all to Him I owe. Sin had left the crimson stain, He washed it white as snow. And when before the throne I stand in Him complete, Jesus died my soul to save, my lips shall still repeat. Jesus paid it all, all to Him I owe. Sin crimson stain he washed it white as snow Jesus paid it all and surely he did today Lord I thank you for another day that you've given us God I pray that you will help us to make a difference in the lives of those that we come in contact with Lord not so uh, they can speak well of us but Lord so they can speak well of you we love you we thank you in Jesus name amen God bless you folks no devotion tomorrow morning on Sunday, but if you do uh, check this Facebook page, you will uh, see our service, and then, um, of course, um, we'll see you again on Monday morning, starting this new year off right. God bless you.